So this is a really good answer to the data science interview or case study question that I posed in an earlier example. The question was this, if an e-commerce retailer such as Best Buy could prioritize whether or not they put like high margin, high profitability products at the top of their homepage or to have the door busters, which are, should get high conversions, but would be low profit per order. And a lot of people might just tell the interviewer that we should just focus on something like revenue per order or profit per order. And there's nothing wrong with that. But what I wanted to emphasize to you guys was to talk about the trade-offs of the metrics. So when you have something like profit per order, which is ultimately the metric we care about, it's generally a low power metric. On the other hand, something like a conversion rate is a high power metric, and you'd be able to get an impact of the conversion rate in a short period of time, but you kind of miss out on the important piece, which is that we actually care about profit per user. But what Jason did here, and I really like it, is that he recognized that we were talking about this trade-off of whether or not you would have enough sample size, and he took a stand, and he said, we know that profit per user is what we like ultimately want, and he believes that a company like Best Buy should have enough traffic that they can reasonably test it. So when I'm in an interview, I want to first talk about the options that I have for metrics, and then I want to justify my choice. So I still want to take a stand, but I want to justify why I am choosing one metric over another or one measurement strategy over another.